While inflation is impacting virtually every part of our life, it's especially noticeable when it comes to how we drive. In the last year, the cost of motor, motor vehicle parts has gone up nearly 15%. And that problem can be made even worse in rural parts of the state where public transportation is a little more limited. But a program in Louisa County is hoping to help. Caroline Colburn has been talking to the people running that program and she joins us live this morning. Hi, Caroline. Well, good morning, Rob. Car repairs, as many know, they're expensive. And if you live in a rural area like Louisa County where you don't have public transportation, if you can't afford those repairs, that can often mean not being able to get to work to care and provide for your family. Now, I spoke with uh, Lloyd Runnett, who says this is an unfortunate reality for many people who live in Louisa County. He oversees the county's resource council and says inflation has hit their families hard and they've seen a rise in the need for free food. A recent study showed that they conducted also showed a need for car repairs. So the council partnered with the career and technical education students at Louisa County High School, as well as some local repair and part shops to launch wheels for work. So five people a month will receive a voucher worth $500 and the council will pay for the car parts. The students handle the repairs. Take a listen to the high school automotive instructor at Louisa High School, as well as a student about how this program is impacting them. My my biggest thing for these kids is like trying to ingrain like grit in them. Um, the the mindset that maybe at the end of the day you're not done because you're working on somebody's livelihood. They don't have a way to get home or get to work. It goes to show like you're helping out someone who really needs Now, the Resource Council says that they've already received dozens of applications from people hoping to benefit from the program, and you must already be receiving help from Louisa County's Resource Council in order to qualify. They'll then select those five people a month, but they're hoping to help even more than five people, so they're accepting donations if you're willing to help them out so they can help even more families get that reliable transportation. Robin Reba. That could use it, too. Mm -hmm. Thank you. Caroline Colburn reporting live for us. All right. Five